Hello, my name is Santiago Menko and I will tell you a little about how John Lennon died. John Winston Lennon, Liverpool, October 9, 1940, New York, December 8, 1998, was a British artist, musician, singer, songwriter, activist, composer, producer, writer, and pacifist known for being the leader of the leader and founder of the band rock The Beatles and considered one of the most influential artists of the 20th century. It was around 10.50 p.m. on December 8 of the 98th. Shortly after Lennon and Ono returned to the Dakota the New York apartment where they live. Mark David Chapman at the entrance to the building shot Lennon in the back five times, four of which hit the back and left shoulder. He was taken to the emergency room at Nervy Roosevelt Hospital and pronounced dead of arrival at 11 p.m. That same day in the afternoon, Lennon had autographed a copy of the Double Fantasy for Chapman. The next day, Ono released a statement saying, There is no funeral for John, Con concluding with the words, John loved and prayed for the human race. Please don't the same for him. His body was cremated at Fernifleet Cemetery in Hartstead, New York. Ono scattered his Hashes in Central Park, where the Strawberry Files Memorial was later created. Chapman was convicted of the second degree murder and was sentenced to life in prison, with the possibility of parole after 20 years. Seclusion is currently still in jail, having been a repeatedly denied parole. In, in his childhood, John Lennon used to go to church frequently since he was a church boy. So it was from there that he was provided with the vocal harmonies that he would later perform with the Beatles and on his solo solo albums. As if that were not enough, Lennon also used to attend the Boy Scouts, something rare for his rebellious character in his jokes.